Welcome back, everyone. Drake Hawkins with you again. We're back for some more Surviving Mars Episode 3 in our 1,075% difficulty, extreme, ridiculous, hardest difficulty nonsense with no friends and neighbors. Yeah, it's going to be great. <clears throat> Pardon me. So, last episode, we ended off and it popped up this new planetary anomalies for us. So, we got a few projects potentials here. Um... Before we get started, if you're enjoying the series, please hit that like button, it helps me out. And if you haven't already joined the clan, hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more great content. Well, one's right beside us. What is this? Three botanists needed. Well, we don't have any of those. Project Fahrenheit. Okay. And the other is Project Flamingo. Five engineers. Well, neither of those are going to happen anytime soon. That was a lackluster scenario. Uh, okay, so this is shut off because it needs repairs and we don't need to make more fuel right now. 35 fuel in storage. Uh, I was looking at this and I think what I'm going to do is up here we're going to put in a water storage and an air storage and have them isolated from everything, including the production, I think. We might have a moisture vaporator up there, but I'm not sure. We're definitely going to have them isolated, so if we get a leak... I can shut it off. Um, and I'm also going to have one on the a valve on the other side of the dome. So that if the leak's over here, I can shut the dome off. And so the dome can still be connected to the storage. Out coming from here, where we have a water production and a water storage, I think we'll put in a valve there as well. Probably have to remove this thing for the temporary to connect through, and then we can always you know, replace it later. Yeah, I think that'll be a good idea. Hmm. Okay. Uh, so we got a uh, electrostatic dust storm arriving in five hours. That's rough. And a uh, meteor storm arriving in 22 hours. So the electrostatic dust storm, if it lasts more than four and a half souls, we're hooped. Because it'll be a dust storm. We can't even land. But it, it is electrostatic. They, used, they tend to be shorter. This guy is 8%, uh, 9% of the way here. So, he's not going to get down before that dust storm for sure, but hopefully he'll get down when it ends. Um, so the dust storm's going to end. Uh, we can... Yeah, that'll be shut off. Okay. No problems. This guy is going to be a bit... That's fine. All, all is good. So this will be shut off, which means I can entirely disconnect. I want you to come over here and finish this dome now. Okay, moisture evaporator can go down later. <clears throat> I guess the dust storm is hitting in a few seconds. Well, hours. All right, guys, get to work. Um, I'd like them to be able to operate this. Not quite, huh? There we go. Okay, here comes the electrostatic dust storm. Bam, lightning bolt. Bam, lightning bolt. <laughs> Just barely missed us twice. Uh, moisture evaporator offline, understood. This is going to be disconnected. That's not going to be doing anything. Drone. Oh. Really, dudes? Fix my bros. Oh, you're fixed. There you go. <laughs> Excellent. So they'll pump that stuff in real quick. Hopefully, get that operational before too long. Really? Are we, are we fussing with work on that? Get over here. I do not want you to work on that. I really, really don't want you to work on that. Thanks. Just dump everything in here, guys. The polymers are in. The metals are... We're out of metals, okay? You need to go grab a piece of metal. And you need to go also uh, recharge. And you can go grab a piece of metal. Now, if this guy just grabs this and I don't give him any orders, is he going to do something? No. Go deliver. Good, that'll be the last two pieces of metal. Finished and delivered. Okay, just come over here then. Uh, good, deliver that piece of metal, and it's finished. There we go, dome is going to go online. We are going to finish it or not. Uh, wait a second, what does it take to maintain is concrete? So that's fine. Um, <clears throat> let's remove these. Uh, actually, no. 
don't need those. We will drop the demand on that, and that can go down to 10, and this can go down to like 30. Now, you're going to be maintained with concrete. We need to put in um, living quarters and services real fast. Did we ever get that special tech? Yeah, we did. Um, we're working on farms. That's excellent. If that goes in in time, that'll be good. That's very good, actually. Hmm, I like that. Hmm. I like it a lot. Uh, one and... One and two. Do the polymers after that, and then whatever. Then you can do... Um, doesn't matter. <laughs> we'll probably switch that. Okay, so we will let him finish this. Let them finish this. <clears throat> and as soon as we're done that, I want to reconnect Research you to complete. the... Milestone there we go. Hmm, soil adaptation finishes. Um, Logi fungus? No, I think uh, we'll do that and then the Logi. And because none of these are priority right now, this would be nice. Subsurface heater would drop our power use substantially. Because that dome is going to take a lot of power to run in the cold. This will give us a... You know what? Do that, then that. No. Subsurface heaters, then the polymers factory, then the... farm. Is there anything urgent? No, I think that's fine. That's, that's a decent order. Okay, so you're not connected, of course, to anything. So before you go any further, let's go over here. Let's actually slow things down just a little so I don't get myself in trouble time-wise. All right, that and then the power switch there. Now, I would like a storage device for water. Can I tuck it in any further up here? No, that's good. That'll fit there. And then uh, another, then a, an air storage. Um, right in there. And I think we'll put our moisture evaporator in here. But it has to be past the cables and switches, yes? Good, just like that. Now that can be stopped. Pause, don't, don't build that. Um, build those though. We will need a, a, a moxie input, so <clears throat> um, I don't want it connected there. I want it connected there. Good. All right. Uh, meteor storm, one soul, thirteen hours. Okay. Yeah, I know, I know what a meteor storm is. Thanks. Um, life support on the dome is out. Got it. Built a dome. That's good. Humans on Mars in fifty-nine percent. So they'll make it, I think. Really hope they do. I will be supremely disappointed if they do not. Um, and then you're going to pipe along here to connect the services to this. Because this needs to fill. O oxygen and water needs to fill there. The dome is going to take one water. The dome is going to need another water source for uh, its farming. And we're probably going to have to put in a water extractor. Now, where's... how close can he get without... Oh, without kicking dust? That's as far as he's gonna get. So if we do that, and then um, we connect that to there to there. Mm, no. Yes, no. Yes, no, I want the... Oh man, I'm trying to think the this through, because last time, one of the things I did not do well was manage the um, access to resources. So during disasters, we had a lot of trouble. You can catch that in the other videos if you're new to the channel, but we had a lot of trouble where disasters struck and we had, you know, sometimes four, to, late, late game we'd have five six thousand water stored and the base would consume it in a single five day storm two souls seven hours are you kidding me 
Hour zero of soul 12. Okay, so we have an entire soul here. So we'll be at 12, 13, 14 by the time they're ready to land. Oh, that's going to be tight. That's going to be real tight. Man, okay. Uh, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Then it really won't matter after that. We're not going to get anywhere near that. Okay. Rare metals. Production is probably going to be our top priority after that. Machine parts and the water extractors. That's the problem. Okay, then if I do these. Something like this. Something like this sort of thing. That's the plan, anyways. But the electrostatic dust arm is still two souls away. That would be a foolish thing to put in right now, Drake. A very foolhardy thing to do. Let's take that out of there, because all that's going to do is waste resources and then have breaks and cracks in the pipes during a storm. That would be super dumb. Uh, this would also be super dumb, because we don't need those right now, and they would just also cause troubles. I should have thought of that <clears throat> before. We can't connect any of that because it's of no use to us right now. So, what is of use to us right now would be connecting this and putting power in here. Now, how are we going to connect power? I don't know if that I want to use solar, but I kind of do. A sterling generator. Mm, here? Here. No. A sterling generator down here. Like anywhere, honestly, can touch here and it'll still power. It'll be exclusively connected to this dome. All of this stuff's going to use this entire thing of power just to maintain it. Uh, that's a lot of power use. So that'll run all this stuff. Okay. The dome should have prior priority for sure. So don't do that. Um, power systems over here. Let's put them over this way then. Tough choices. Whoa, 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 oh, no, 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 can't lose prefabs. Uh, Drone attempts to <coughs> put a square part into a round hole in the third for the third consecutive time determined to find a solution. Oh, <coughs> we seem to be missing some parts for our Sterling Generator prefab. I placed it twice. Every time you place it, there's a chance. Chance of fixing the building or losing the drone. Oh man, we're not gonna. If we lose a drone, I'd rather lose a drone. Sterling generator has been constructed, but it will require additional maintenance every time the building malfunctions. How often is this building gonna malfunction? Oh my goodness! Taking manual co uh, control over the drone, we were able to put things together. Same. Oh, man. Okay, so look at that. Maintenance is two polymers. Maintenance is one polymer. So you're not. You're never going to get opened up. <laughs> um, this thing is demanding 30 power already. Uh, wow. Okay. <clears throat> Oops. Um, we have power problems. Do we have the machine parts to power these things? Um, now, this takes the same to maintain, but two activities, produces 10 power, what's the elevation? 75% elevation bonus, that is really good, 10 and 20 power there. Plus 75% bonus. That's these two alone are enough to power this. Plus this for the five and ten. 
probably enough. Probably. That's four machine parts, though. Resources are low. Man. Okay. Then we can uh, we can power switch that off if we need to. It doesn't matter. Electric electricity loss is not a big deal to us. You stay closed at all times. Okay, let's let's do some building here. Now we're gonna need. We got power to it, or sort of, not really. <laughs> You're short on power. Um, you're already taking. D oh right, I let it finish. Man, I should have waited. Should have waited. Jeepers! Should have waited for a lot of stuff. <clears throat> this stuff is going to. What are we pulling out? Are we ripping that apart? Okay, don't run through the. Don't run through. Don't be electrocuted. Phew. Didn't hurt them. Okay. Two souls left. What are you going to work on? Lots and lots of stuff still. Okay, these guys take concrete and machine parts. We don't really need to bring this online. We are going to waste con concrete in that repair. Uh, we have... Oh, man. Ooh, Drake's a shaking. This is nerve-wracking because I don't know that we've got the capacity to get this done. Man, this is super tight. Sector okay, so scan. Metals there. We don't have the metals connected, do we? No. Let's uh, let's go over here and tell them to bring 40 metals in here. We really use that. Oh, you know what? We need a landing pad. Let's put the landing pad down first. Can we fit that in there? Yes, but how? But no, but maybe, but yes. <laughs> uh, okay. Where was it? There? We can fit it as low as there. Let's do that. Make him priority. That sounds dumb, but we want him to be able to land, for sure. <clears throat> we do have water stored. If we connect it later, it'll help. There's 34 water stored anyways. Um, man. We need... We almost need to bring... Okay, I'm tempted to drop a pod with a prefab drone hub. And what? Polymers? Machine parts? Machine parts. And a drone. Funding zero. Five more machine parts, because we'll need them for the the everything. Polymers we don't need for anything yet. We're not building any apartments, because we can't afford them for the polymers. Okay, we're going to bring this. This is going to bring us a drone. Uh, he's an electronics guy. He's electronics maintenance. Okay. All right. <clears throat> But we need we need the work workflow to get this done. I'm not sure how we're gonna get the electronics. Hmm. Man, nerve wracking. All right, at least we can land the dude right there. Heavy workload indeed. That's the problem. We don't have enough work in ha happening to make this function. Anomaly found. Anomaly? Oh, too far away. Well, there's that's a nice feature. The drone or the meteor storm's not going to crash on our head. I forgot about that. One soul, 12 hours left. We're almost done, soul 12. We'll have seven, uh, five hours. One soul, five hours. We'll make it to 13, 14, five. So we'll have almost a full day to land the rocket. But that's it. 
<laughs> that is a tight achievement when you're on this difficulty. <clears throat> Barring any other crazies, we might actually make this. We're at 69, 70%. We'll probably be able to land it the moment it happens. Alright, um, this is an awkward place for this. If I could remove that, that would be awesome. Let's put our universal in the middle, nice universally located, uh, like um, there. That would be lovely. <clears throat> I'd like that and that gone and that gone. We will tell this to get 10 of each. <clears throat> They'll actually give us a shuttle. That's interesting. A jump shuttle will happen if we can get these uh, guys online. 97, 99, and land. He's going to land there without any damages to the base. That's awesome. And you're going to disassemble Glitter Hoof 1, apparently. Oops. Got to name you the uh, Postman 2. We'll, we'll, we'll pretend you were named the Postman 2, okay? That'll make me feel better. Now, <clears throat> you landed with a prefab. So, we have a prefab here. What are we gonna, where are we going to put him? I think he's kind of got to go right in there. Or there. Right there. That'll be about as universal as it can be. It'll catch, catch everything, including the water. Future water location. That is a prefab, so let's... Uh, let's prioritize you to build that immediately. Online, you're not connected. Of course you're not. Um, one unit of metal there, please. Hello? No? Okay. Why are you not able to work? Work on this construction. Somebody, please? That's kind of priority. Oh, you know what? They are working on it. They're emptying out this. Oh, I conveniently made that right on the concrete. Okay, that's fine. They'll have to unload that before we. this guy can go to work. And, and somebody stole his metal. There we go. Now work on that. No, oh, somebody's already on it. Okay, fine. Do something, dude. Do something useful somewhere. Okay, seriously? Work on this construction. Thank you. Power it. There we go. Okay. You need to be top priority of everything. Oh my goodness, already. Oh, I st oh, stupidly built it. Oh, Drake, the electrostatic dust storm is still 19 hours long. It's gonna... Oh, it's gonna entirely break that thing down before the dust storm is over. Okay, so in tier inside here... We're going to need to build living complexes. Uh, we're going to go one, two, and three living complexes. Uh, no, two living complexes to begin with. Um, over here will be a connection to this dome second, or this dome second. I'm not sure which. So those two connections. Uh, so we need partial service buildings in here. Let's go with the... Uh, Nursery can be right here. And I think we'll have... Do we have a school for playing? Uh, probably not necessary if we could do playing with a... Park, right? Yes. Alleys and parks and whatnot can do playing as well. So... Mm, <clears throat> okay. We will put a small fountain in there. And we will put a small fountain down here. Those fountains will be my placeholders for tunnels. Services. I'd love a school, but we can't afford the electronics. Can't afford the electronics. Um, nurseries are concrete and concrete. We need, we need breeding, basically, is all we need to do. We just need to make babies. That's, that's the top priority right now. Make babies. Um, infirmary, let's go with, uh, grocer. And, actually, a small grocer is probably going to cut it. <clears throat> yep, 
and a diner. There. And let's put a uh, security building in here. Um, definitely not art stores or electronic stores. Small space bar. Yeah, maybe a small space bar. Relaxation, drinking, and social. Okay. And then we put in some garden here. A little rock garden in there. We got a couple uh, fountains here. And then we're going to need space in here for. Um, factories that will not be built the small no, I can't do either of those um, <clears throat> oh wait we can research these right use resupply bring prefabs or research the technology okay so we can make those later that's good game developer no thanks funny nice try oh we need a farm so let's put the farm in here mm-hmm and then I guess fill this with happiness things, like uh, parks, stone garden. What else can they? What else would they like? They'd like a nice little lake, uh, beautiful, lovely lake right there. Pretend it's a reservoir. A nice garden back here. And what about an alley to go from the stone to the? Um, there we go. From the lake to the stone garden that's that's fantastic um, okay so all of that <clears throat> needs to be done is there anything here that takes stuff other than concrete I don't think so a little bit of metal it's fine a little more metal okay so a lot of concrete living quarters needs to be priority both of those uh one of those only one needs to be built, actually. That one can be shut off entirely. <clears throat> okay. I hope the kids can play in a, in a normal storage. A normal storage. <laughs> Shove the kids in the storage locker. Not what I meant, guys. Not what I meant. Uh, I meant to say I hope the kids can use the uh, parks for their play. Now, how are we doing? We have 17 hours for that to clear. 92% will make it down in time. Question is, uh, are we going to get this done in time? Okay, you need to be what two maybe? You need any any need for this at all? Metals. Yeah, you need to harvest the metals. Seven more. There's there any other metals in range? No. So you're going to need to get up here and harvest metals once he's done. Um, let's go with, uh, down to two, you can come over here, drop your range, okay, so just work that, please, we have 15 machine parts in there, yay, <clears throat> now you can reach all of that, except for that little bits of metal, okay, as soon as he dumps the metal off, I'm going to take you up north here and get you going on mining some other resources. Metal deposit uh, right up about there, and we'll get him up there to gather a ton of metal. There we go. Dump, dump, and okay. I want you to run right up here, throw your workload their size to full, add the other dudes in here that were free. Good. That's eight of you. Nice. That'll get things rolling. Okay. Now, this needs concrete. Right? The concrete's going to come over here. That's fine. Uh, one more concrete in here should get him started. Good. That'll be the living quarters online. We do need these two. That's not, not supposed to finish. No, no, no. Stop finishing. Don't finish those, please. Yet. 
As long as we got the materials there, I'm fine. Uh, that can be maintained. Where are you going? Living complex? Okay, you're going to go help with something that's already finished, dude. It's all but done. Okay. <clears throat> that needs to be done. You get the materials. There's six hours left and we can turn this on. How long in this electronics damage? Sector scan. Man, Anomaly bad. found. Oh, good. Good, good. A key. Okay, that'll bring us some more research. Or awareness of new research, I suppose, is the proper way to put that. Mm, and we are out of time for today. So, next episode, we are landing our fantastic friends here. So, we have 12 colonists inbound. They have a, oh, they're already in orbit. They're awaiting the last three hours as they prep before they land. And uh, they'll be able to get in there, I hope. <laughs> I really hope they can reach. Um, they'll, they'll run over here, and they've got a living quarters already set up for them. 14 available spaces. Uh, we do need the power connected, so let's make that happen. And, uh, yeesh, yikes. That's got to happen right away. Uh, this is almost ready to go online. But I don't know that we... I think we'll shut that down. And we'll leave that off as well. I wish this was connected somewhere else. I wish I could relocate that. But we will connect it up later. After the storm, I guess. We can probably just disconnect, like run a line, have a switch on either end, and just totally disconnect them. Switch right in here, maybe. Yeah, that's probably what we'll do. But anyways, that'll be in next episode. Thank you, everybody, for joining me. Hopefully we make it here. Let me know in the comments what you think, and we will see you in-game.